Hello everyone, Darkplane here, back playing some more AFK Arena. And in this video, I want to look at the rewards that I'm going to get from the Treasure Trove in the Misty Valley. So if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. It'll help you get notified on when I post new videos. So let's go on with the video. Okay, I'm going to go to the Misty Valley. The Misty Valley has already started, and I'm just waiting for the couple days that are needed to finish the last half of it. So, uh, yeah, here it is. Yeah, I'm just waiting for this boss. Opens in two and a half days from now. So, as soon as that opens, I'll be going through here, and I'll complete everything, and then I'll make it over here to the treasure trove. Yeah, yeah, you, you get here as soon as you beat the uh, final final stage of the Misty Valley. And uh, yeah, you're, you're able to get a different number of, re of rewards based on which chapter of the campaign you're on. So yeah, I, there, there are a total of 15 slots here. They added these uh, last five slots pretty recently. So I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start with this one here, just show which rewards I'm gonna be getting here. Starting with this one, you get uh, your basic resources. I'm going to go for the Essence. I, I always need Essence from here. Uh, the second one here, from this one, I'm going to uh, go for the Twisted Essence. Because, yeah, Twisted Essence are pretty, are pretty rare to get. And the third one, I'm going for the uh, 60... I'm going for the 60 Elite Soul Stones. Now the 720 rare soul stones sounds nice, but with the 60 elite soul stones, you have a chance at getting celestial or hypogean heroes from it. So that that's always cool, and I, that, that's that's the main reason why I choose that one. And the fourth one, once again, I'm going to go for the 60 elite soul stones because the five normal scrolls that's not even a full ten pull, and the po coins that's not even a full ten pull of furniture either. And the fifth one up here, uh, I'm going to go for the red chest. Uh, yeah, I, I always want red chests from here. And the primordial emblems, I have a lot of, and the amplifying emblems, they're, they're just not as important to me as the red chests are. Now the sixth one here, I'm going to go for the tier 3 stone chest. Yeah, the, I get tier 1 and tier 2 gear from the uh, AFK rewards because of the uh, Field of Stars. I get that from, get the Tier 1 and Tier 2 gear from there. So I don't really need Tier 1 or Tier 2 stones as much as I used to. And the seventh one, uh, for me, for me, it's really, it's really between uh, the 200 Elemental Shards and the 10 uh, Red Chests because the elemental uh, shards are relatively new compared to the uh, red chests, and also I I feel like I need more of these so that more of the elemental shards so that I can get more heroes engraving up. So yeah, for now I'm gonna choose the elemental shards. I might switch between the elemental shards and the red chests, but for now it's gonna be I'm gonna choose the elemental shards. And the eighth one here. Once again, I'm going to choose the 60 Elite Soul Stones, based on the reasoning that I had for the one before. And the ninth one, this one you're able to choose a specific hero, and I believe it has, I believe it also has the newer heroes on here as well. Yeah, it has Thescu and Tresnor. I'm going to go for Tresnor because I'm focusing on focusing on him at the moment. I just need uh, three more copies actually to get him ascended, so yeah, getting getting extra copies of him would be very nice. And the tenth one, for this one, I'm gonna choose the elemental cores uh, because yeah, I feel like I need more engraving resources than I do a red chest. The red chests are very good, and the, yeah, the signature item signature items are very good, but. I just want to start building uh, engraving. So now we move on to the the bottom five, which are the newest ones. 
and with this one uh, I'm going to go for elemental cores again because I want to build in the engravings of of all the heroes and this one this one's a pretty close battle between the elemental cores and the twisted essence I really need both of them so uh, for now I'm gonna choose the elemental cores yeah I, I might switch to the twisted essence later but for now I'm, I'm gonna choose elemental cores for the uh, 13th one here I'm gonna choose the elemental cores I'm gonna go all out with the engraving for this one and the 14th one once again I'm gonna choose the elemental cores for that one and the final one this one is pretty much the same as uh, this one here I'm gonna choose tier 3 stones so I'm getting two tier 3 stones out of this every month which is really good uh, getting the essence the both twisted essence and the regular essence here getting three uh, three uh, elite poles here getting some red chests and and a few uh, engraving resources as well and also the new hero so that's what these are the 15 that I'm choosing for now yeah I, I might change them I, I don't know I might change the engraving resources to maybe to maybe the red chests or I, or I might just keep them the same here I'm not quite sure what I'm, I'm gonna do so if you haven't already please subscribe like and comment comment what do you think about the treasure trove and what do you think about the misty valley in general and thanks for watching